Only the real Persona 3 fans know about this. Yeah. But I'm sorry, Atlas. Yo ass gotta get this ring. So Persona 3 Reloaded doesn't have the FES content. I've known about this for a few uh, months now. And I just now am, I'm in the mood to do rants and talk shit, you know. Um, so here we are. And there are some other games I've seen that's coming out that I'm interested in. But I'm just going to wait on it because I see them getting into that scummy scum category of these dubs. That's being uh, very greedy. My biggest problem with this Persona 3 Reload, that's what it's called. This is the remake. Why in the fuck doesn't it have the FES content? Let's rewind. The beginning of this year, they brought out Persona 3, the PSP version. Along with that, they brought out Persona 4 Golden. They brought this to the consoles. It was already... The Persona 4 Golden was already on Steam, but they brought that to uh, PS4, Xbox, Switch, along with the PSP of Persona 3. I didn't buy, I didn't buy the, the PSP version. Why would I? I already played the superior version, and I still own the superior version. So I can just bring out my PS3 and play it if I really want to. But, not going to lie, I was happy that this was announced. This is this guy that's in this, this stream that I'd be in. He was telling me there was rumors and links about it. I didn't believe him until I actually saw that trailer drop. That it yeah, got leaked. And, uh... Side 4, it looks just like Persona 5, got all the nice aesthetics, visuals. But uh, once I found out, I don't know that guy name, I don't know what his position is in the company, but he said they don't plan to give the FES content, and that right there really pissed me off. I'm not going to spoil the game for y'all, but if you haven't played the PSP version already, and you're just going to play this one, I mean, you're not messing up for anything. You're going to get pretty much the same ending, an incomplete ending. And that's why I'm at. Also, this game is going to be a full next-gen price. If y'all don't know, ever since the PS5 and the new Xbox came out, the price got a $10 boost. So a lot of these uh, devs and companies are starting to add extra $10 to their game price, and even though a lot of these games don't deserve the extra 10. But a lot of these companies are doing that, and Atlas, they're one of them. They're doing that, and they didn't even give us the full goddamn game. So we want back to the beginning. Like I said, they, they re-released the, the PSP version this year. And they decide to announce a remake this year. But they don't give us the goddamn full content. And the guys talking about... There's no plans for FES. If he's not lying, then that's some bullshit. And if he, well, he, he, I won't spend on the tell the truth because he's trying to milk it. He's trying to milk it just like they asked milk Persona 5. We got Persona 5. I bought that day one. Persona 5 Royal, we didn't see that coming. I bought that day one. Persona 5 Tactica, I'm going to get it. Not buying it day one. I'm going to get that on sale. I'm going to get this Persona 3 Reload on a sale. And I'm not buying any of these third-party people games day one anymore because they're being greedy. They're being scummy scums. Especially with this Persona 3 remake. I am so mad that this thing does not have F the FES content. For real. So, oh, man. I'm just going to probably... Boot up my PS3, because that's the only way I could play the FES, because I have it on my PS3. So, unless they actually do put out a Persona 3 Platinum, whatever it's going to be called, whatever version that's going to be equivalent to Royal, then I'm going to hold off as long as possible of not buying Reload. I have some hope that they actually will give a version with the FES, but they don't, then they just don't. And I'm just going to buy, buy it at the lowest price I can get it. I'm not not going to be uh, supporting them. They're not getting no hard-earned money. They're going to get some uh, on-sale price money from me from now on. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty shitty. 
pretty shitty that they're not giving us the full game, even though they kind of prepped it up. PSP remake re-release, then they want to announce it with no FES. To be honest, the only remake out there that's worth it is that Final Fantasy VII, y'all. Because that Final Fantasy VII is not only a remake, it's a retelling. Everything is not the same. The stories is mixed. It's like a lot of hard work, hard effort put into it. Not not just Persona 3. Really reload. And before you try to talk shit to me, don't try to talk shit to me. Because like I said, I played all the Persona games before Persona 5 was, came out. I was in the bandwagoner. Persona 3 is my favorite Persona game. That's why I'm mad. That is to have the FES and they charge in full price. They milk, like I said, they milk Persona 5. We got Persona 5, Persona 5 Royal. Then they make a next gen version of Persona 5 Royal, which I don't know why. What the fuck are they gonna do? How how can you make I can't make an anime game look even more crisper than it is? And I guess some little frame boost, which I don't care about that little crap. But that was not worth the finesse. They're becoming greedier and scummier, just like all these other devs. And I'm not going to support them. I'm only going to start supporting just the first party people because most of the first party people, they'll give you a nice quality, full, complete game. And these third parties not doing it. A lot of these third parties are finessing. Let's just jump to a different game real quick. So that Naruto... Baruto Connections game is coming out. I'm going to get it. I ain't going to lie. Because they got one costume. No, they got two costumes I want. It's a pre-order costume. You pre-order the game, you'll get a, a nice Naruto costume. You're going to get you a nice Sasuke costume. They got some deluxe edition. We got like a season pass with some other characters. I don't know what the fuck five other characters you can get. You should have the whole roster just from the base game. But they have some other five characters. I'm guessing it's probably going to be a goddamn alternate version of someone i don't know they got freaking the unmasked kakashi who the fuck cares about that i guess some people care about it. i don't care about that and some trash costumes i saw but uh, this annoys me when i see some of this stuff happening to games that i like so i just feel like talking about it fuck you atlas i'm buying all your games on sale for now on not on low not on the little the little Five ten dollars off sale. No, I'm buying that shit when it's like damn near ten dollars. But yeah, I'll just have to enjoy Persona Three FES on my PS3. Why I enjoy the nice, nice touched up version with a ending that's not satisfying at all. Yep, yep, yep. That's all I gotta say. TK TKRDS. Like I said, fuck you, Atlas. And all those bandwagoners that might try to comment or dislike my video, fuck y'all too. Because y'all don't know shit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm going a little crazy with my rant now. But anyways, I just want to do a rant. It's funny. Last rant I did was like a Yu-Gi-Oh rant. But uh, yeah. More rants to come maybe. Who knows. But anyways, Final Fantasy the only one that's doing the remakes correctly. I'm sorry, but it's true. Five pins, you only want to do it right. But anyways, I'm out for real. Adios. Peace.